In this video, shared by Dr. Joao Marcos Rainier from Goiânia, Brazil, we will discuss a case of regmatogenous retinal detachment in an open funnel configuration. This is the case of a patient with an 8-month history of regmatogenous retinal detachment in an open funnel. We can observe significant vitreoretinal proliferation due to the chronicity of the detachment. Triamcinolone is used to stain the vitreous, and the subretinal fluid is drained through the superior retinal break. Perfluorocarbon is then injected until it reaches just below the level of the primary break, and a 360-degree retinectomy is performed. For this, endocautery is used for marking. Endocautery is essential to prevent hemorrhages during the retinectomy. A 360-degree retinectomy is performed using the vitreous cutter. While cutting the inferior retina, the surgeon performs relaxing retinotomies. The anterior retina to the retinectomy is trimmed using the vitreous cutter. Perfluorocarbon is then added to completely fill the vitreous cavity. At this point, a 360-degree endolaser is applied along the entire extent of the retinectomy. Finally, a fluid air exchange is carefully performed to avoid retinal slippage, and the vitreous cavity is filled with silicone oil.